guys welcome back to this channel and if you're new to this channel consider subscribing by the way don't forget to click the bell icon or to press the notification bell you'll be the first to know when i upload a new video for the returning subscribers thank you so much for coming back to this channel and if you're new to this channel please consider subscribing support this channel by pressing the notification and subscribing to this channel by the way feel free to drop a comment in the comment section i'll always be more than happy to get back to you and interact with you how is gratitude calculated in oman like any other gulf country after completing a given uh, contract depending on how you agree with an employer as per the labor laws there's some kind of token that is always given to you as kind of appreciation for the service for the period you've been at that work it is termed as gratitude or end of service bonus. And most of these Gulf countries have what we call end of service bonus. But what should come in your mind? These are different countries and each country has its own rules or it has, it has its own rules on, what to, on how to calculate the end of service bonus or what we call the gratitude. Remember, Gratitude and end of service bonus in the Gulf countries is separated in what you call the articles of the labor laws. In each of these countries, there is one article that talks about the gratitude and end of bonus as to the employees after completing a given, uh, a given period of service at the work. Depending on what kind of contract you signed with the person who recruited you, the company that recruited you, or the person that sponsored you your work visa at that time remember it all depends on which company and which gulf country you are in or you are working in at a time but in this video we are looking at how is gratitude calculated in oman and remember to some gulf countries or even oman that if you don't complete one year with that company, you are not entitled to what we call end of service bonus or what we call gratitude. Gratitude, I said, is just a token or it's just an amount of money or that is, can, is given to you after completing a given, uh, a given number of years or after completing your, say, your contract, depending on how, what you agreed with your employer at one moment of time. So in uh, remember, when we are talking about gratitude in Oman, we cannot fail to mention what you call Article 35 of, well, we cannot uh, fail to mention, uh, we cannot fail to mention Article, uh, that is uh, Article 39 of the 35 uh, 2003 decree, that is uh, those that were amended in Oman to include those articles that specifically specify how much someone is supposed to be getting or how much someone gets after completing a given uh, service or contract with his employers. I'm just going to read through of what I summarize and uh, at, at least we can try to share out something on uh, a little bit of gratitude on Oman. Article 39 of the Labor Law, that is the Royal Decree 35 of 2003, states that, or as follows, the gratitude uh, on the termination of the relationship of workers who are not beneficial of the social insurance uh, law, the employer shall pay the worker a past service gratitude, an amount of wage of one month for each of the following year. Meaning that your employer is supposed to pay gratitude of service of an amount that is not less than uh, uh, 30, that is not less than um, a month, a year for every year. But it all depends on how much or how long you've spent with that employer, how much you've spent with that business. I think to look at one as the basis for calculating, uh, basis for calculating the gratitude in Oman. Remember, the gratitude shall not be payable if the duration of service is less than one year. Hope guys you're getting to pick out something. For you to get gratitude in Oman, you must have served the company you are working in for more than a year. Otherwise, if you serve the company six months of probation or lower than that, 
as per the law in Oman, you are not entitled to gratitude. Number two, employers are eligible for gratitude pay at the end of the service period, at termination, death, while resigning according to Article 39, a worker shall be entitled to a fraction of a year's work provided with a completed year. So you are entitled to gratitude, let it be termination, let it be death, let it be uh, resigning, provided you've exceeded what we call the line which is one year. So long as you are one year and above, you are still entitled to your gratitude as per the Oman law. The drawn basic wage of an employee shall be considered the basic for the calculation of the gratitude. The drawn basic, remember, there is a basic wage that you normally sign as you get that contract. You will say, you so and so you're signing this contract on this day, but your basic salary will be this. So they are trying to look at the basic salary as one a factor that is used in determination. Remember, if you are below, if you are below three years, of, of service let's say for example you've worked with your control your employer but, and you are below 18 service, uh, three years of service then that means you are entitled to 15 days of your gratitude they will only give you 15 days of every year of the fraction of your gratitude and if you've served that company for three years and above you are entitled to 30 days or one full month of gratitude at that same file and remember we say that if you serve the company for less than one year then you are not entitled for growth for gratitude per the labor law thank you so much for coming back to this channel thanks so much to me to this channel if you are not to this channel please consider subscribing support this channel remember we are looking at road to 2000 subscribers but remember it will be your only your force it will be only uh, it will be your only recommendations and only your heart that we can achieve the 2000 subscribers thank you so much see you again it's mix from the mix creation tv